What's up? My name is Kevin Lee, and welcome to Atlassian Answered, the series where we tackle your top questions on all things Atlassian. Today, we're going to be diving into Confluence, what it is, who uses it, and why it's become such a popular tool for teams all across the world. Now, this video will be a very high-level overview, and so if you're looking for a deeper dive into Confluence and how to actually use it, check out the link in the description down below. There, you'll have access to a free Confluence course, as well as our full catalog of on-demand learning. With that being said though, let's get right into the video. So, what is Confluence? Simply put, Confluence is a collaboration tool by Atlassian that helps teams create, store, and share content. And that content typically comes in the form of pages, like the one I'm using to write this video script. In terms of who uses Confluence, it's really everyone from small startups to large corporations, and from technical engineering teams to marketing teams. Now, you may be wondering, what makes Confluence so different from other content writing tools? Well, for one, Confluence allows you to easily organize all of your work within a personal space. There, you can have folders with pages underneath them, and then more pages underneath those pages. It essentially allows you to create a hierarchy of information so that every single document is quick and easy to find. So for example, let's say I'm trying to make a video series on YouTube called I don't know, I lost an answered. I'd start by creating a folder in Confluence where all my information can be stored. Then I'd make a pre-start materials folder and put all my prep documents there. Finally, it's time to start writing my script. So I'll create an initial batch folder and store all my scripts there. As you can see, all my documents are organized in a way that makes everything easy to find. You can also control who sees your conference page with permissions. So if you have confidential information, you could set your page as private and only share it with specific team members. However, if you make it open to all, basically everyone in your company can see your work. This allows Confluence to almost act as a digital library of information, which is extremely helpful for a couple of reasons. The first benefit is reduce redundancy. If you worked at a big company before, you could probably relate to this scenario, where you're super excited to begin this new project, you put all this time doing research to lay a strong foundation, and then lo and behold, someone from a completely different team did the exact same work just two years ago. Simply put, there's often no way to know what everyone has done within an organization of thousands of people. However, with Confluence, you essentially have a library of information of what everyone has worked on, researched over the past however so many years. So before starting any project, you could do a quick Confluence search and see if anyone has worked on something similar or if there's past research that you could learn from. Secondly, if there's any company-wide resources or information that need to be communicated, Confluence is the perfect way to share it. For example, let's say you work in HR and you want to create a page to communicate to your company about employee benefits. Using Confluence, you can make a benefits space with links to pages like PTO or 401k. Employees can then simply look up or navigate to these resources to get their questions answered quickly and easily. Another example is if your company wants to communicate organizational goals to the entire company. All you need to do is make a page on Confluence and send it out. Now, every single one of your employees can stay informed, all without leaving the platform they're already working on. All right, I know that was a lot, and so time to do a quick recap. Confluence is a collaboration tool by Atlassian designed to help companies document, share, and access content. Confluence allows you to organize all your content into spaces, allowing for easy and quick navigation. It also lets you keep your pages private or share them with the entire company, creating a digital library of information for everyone to access. And there you go, an overview of Confluence in a nutshell. Once again, if you're looking to learn more about Confluence or you want to learn how to use it, there's a free course link down below as well as our full catalog of Atlassian learning. And on top of that, join the Atlassian community. There, you can meet other like-minded individuals and get your questions answered. We even have an entire forum dedicated to Confluence, and so see you there. If this video was helpful, drop a like, comment down below, and of course, subscribe to the Atlassian YouTube channel. That's all for this episode, and I'll see you guys in the next one.